Hi guys, it's Gigi again and welcome back to my Joy Junkie Gigi channel. I know it's a mouthful but I like it. So I'm here because I don't have a subscription box to open but rather I found three sort of trial kits. I don't know, I found them in the counter in Sephora where you know where it's near the cashier and then you see all the trial stuff. But the thing is, they're not in trial sizes, they're in full sizes. So I'm talking about the Morphe lip kits where there's um, a lipstick, a lip gloss, and a lip liner in them. So they're not cheap, they're very affordable because it's way lower than the cost of like a Kylie lip kit with a lip liquid lipstick and a lip liner. But this has three items in them, so that's I think it's pretty affordable and I'm such a sucker for like putting um, makeup in like affordable budget kits or sets so I always go for those and since this is like a nude collection I really wanted to try them so Morphe released three sets they have the blushing nude the nude pink and the caramel nude so this one I'm not sure no, actually, I am sure this is not my color. Um, so the thing is, I already swatched or tried these products and filmed them the first time, except that we didn't save the footage. Anyway, so you'll see like um, the products are already used because we already used them. Anyway, so since I still wanted to share with you guys how it all went down, we're going to try them all again and show you how. So we'll start with, I think, the lightest one between all of them is the blushing nude. So we can start with that and then the, the nude pink and then the caramel nude. Blushing nude has the Morphe lipstick in Flirt, which is this one, this bullet, which is actually this bullet. Lip gloss. This lip gloss is called Boho. But this lip liner is called Love Bite. Okay, so let's try to do them now. This is the lip liner. So this is the lip liner. Um, I actually like it as it is. As you can see, I usually fill my whole lips with the lip liner because I feel like um, lipstick stays or the liquid lipstick stays better or longer with the whole lip covered with the lip liner. But you can wear it however you want. Okay, and then oh, where's the lipstick? Then we'll put on the lipstick. So this is this is with the lipstick. Um, at first, when I tried this, it wasn't that easy to apply. Like it was, I don't know if my lips were dry, but uh, it wasn't that easy to apply. Like it wasn't that creamy, or it didn't lid on the lips that easily so I don't know I was just thinking maybe I got a bad batch of lipstick for this one but the color is really nice um, I think if it's more like a, the lighter skinned ladies or gentlemen whoever wants to wear it but for lighter complexion ones because it's a little bit too light for my skin tone but then when you put in the lip gloss, I'm just gonna put it in the middle. I just put it in the middle. 
It looks very sheen and shiny. I actually like it with the lip gloss. But for this color, I... Okay, so it's either it's just a lip liner or the lip liner, lipstick, and lip gloss. So, I don't know. That's a weird combination for me. My husband's like looking, thinking, what does that mean? Anyway. Okay, so next one we're going to try is the nude pink. And then this one has the Morphe lipstick in Wifey. This is the Morphe lipstick in Wifey. So this is the Morphe lip gloss in Pop. And then this is the colored pencil in Baxi. Lip liner in backseat love. Um, I feel like I feel like this is darker than the blushy nude one. It looks nice, just a lip liner. So we'll put in that. So this is the Morphe lipstick. The lip liner with the lipstick. Um, like I said earlier, it doesn't slide on that well. This is the first time I've tried Morphe lip products, so I don't know how the review is or how it gets, how it goes on the lips. Um, I've tried Morphe brushes. I have some, and they're pretty good. And um, it's just this is the first time I've tried Morphe lip products, and yet they're not as creamy as I thought they would be but then maybe I don't know or maybe I just have dry lips so anyway let's just finish it off with the Morphe lipstick and wifey this is very very nice I think it's like this apricot orangey no not orange it's apricot coral sort of color and it does add that nice pop to the lips, it finishes off nicely. I really like their lip liners and lip glosses, so it does look really nice. nice. Okay, last one. We're on the last one, and I already know it's not my color. Just look at the box. It says caramel nude, and then this is more for the darker um, skin um, people. Out there, I don't want to say ladies. It's not nowadays. Not just ladies who use it. Anyway, I'm so scared because the lip liner is this color. Anyway, let's put it on. I'm just gonna leave it like this, just like an outline, and then just go ahead and put the lipstick. Because the lipstick actually has a very um, has a very orangey, um, peachy tone. So look at it because I already dabbed um, the lip liner to it the first time. Anyway, I'm just gonna put it on like this. I'm not gonna fill my my lips with the whole lip liner. Does look pretty. I look at it, it does look pretty. It reminds me of Halloween. It's not bad. For my color, it, it's, it's good for Halloween for my color. So, anyway, let's put in the lip gloss. Did I show you the lip gloss? I didn't, right? This is the lip gloss. Um, so, let's put it on. Now, my lips look like caramel. looks nice. Now that the lip, the lip gloss is there, 
It actually does look nice. It does look caramelly. <laughs> wow, I'm like pleasantly surprised that I do like it like this. Let's just see now what my husband thinks of it. <laughs> so those are the three um, the three lip kits that Morphe has. The blushing nude, nude pink, and the caramel nude. So they're called out of the pouch. Um, would I recommend them? Yeah. If you really like nudes like me, um, they're, they're all on like on the pink side. Except the last one is very on the brown side. But um, yeah, I think it's worth a try. Um, I won't recommend getting all of them because the first two kind of have like the same um, shade to it. But uh, yeah, it's fun to experiment. Yeah, I would. I bought all of them. Well, my husband bought all of them for me to try, and it's it's fun to play with. So, um, <laughs> so thank you for joining me in this review, and I hope guys you like it. Um, till the next time, bye.